How does a doctor or orthopedic surgeon determine if a knee ligament injury, like an ACL, MCL, or PCL tear, is a grade one, grade two, or grade three injury? In this video, I answer that question and explain how the grade of injury affects treatment options. My name is Dr. David Geyer, triple board certified orthopedic surgeon, sports medicine specialist, and anti-aging and regenerative medicine expert. I help you feel, look, and perform your best regardless of age or injury. This video is part of my Ask the Doctor video series based on questions you've left me in the comments to the videos on my YouTube channel. Here's the question, very simple. How do you differentiate between a grade one, grade two, and grade three PCL injury? And before I answer, just know this information is just that, it's information. It's meant for educational and informational purposes only. I am not giving medical advice in this video or any video on any social media site or my website. Now, the way that ACL, PCL, uh, MCL injuries are classified as grade one, two, three are basically this, but there's different ways to determine it. But essentially it's grade one, meaning the ligament is still intact. The fibers are just stretched out. Grade two, it's a partial tear of the ligament. Grade three, it's a complete tear of the ligament. And that is determined in different ways. One is by physical exam, how much that joint moves or opens up uh, in physical exam. And again, it depends. It's a little different with ACL, PCL, and MCL in terms of the direction that you're trying to demonstrate that. But with the ACL, you can determine that to a certain extent with what's called a Lachman's maneuver with a PCL. It's a posterior drawer test. And with the MCL, it's valgus stress testing, open up the medial side of the joint. So physical exam is one way to get a sense of strain or stretch of the ligament, partial tear or complete tear, how much that joint moves or opens up in terms of a specific amount of stress. And there's certain numbers of millimeters that sort of classify that. The more common way that's determined is of course an MRI that shows you, is that ligament stretched? Is it partially torn? Is it completely torn? Now, just real quickly, the partial ACL tear can be a little misleading because you can still have some of the fibers still intact, some of them torn, but the fibers that are intact may be stretched out enough that the knee is not stable. So you have to be a little weary of these what are called high grade partial ACL tears. Those are usually clinically unstable, essentially complete ACL tears. But where it matters is that stretches of the ligament, but generally the ligament is intact. There's no partial tear. Generally, that knee ligament injury doesn't need surgery. The grade one ACL, MCL, or PCLs typically don't need surgery. The grade threes typically do. Yes, I know there's some debate about that with grade three MCLs or grade three PCLs, but a lot of times those need surgeries. The gray areas are the grade twos. Very good discussion to have with your orthopedic sports medicine specialist and combine the physical exam information, combine the MRI information with feelings of instability doing functional activities. And that goes a long way in determining surgery or no surgery. Now, if you have an orthopedic injury and you want to hear about options other than cortisone shots and other than surgery, click the link in the description under this video fill out the contact form and find out more about scheduling an appointment with me. I'd also love to hear your experience with your injury, knee injury or otherwise. You can leave those in the comments below. Just understand if you leave a question in the comments, I can't offer you medical advice. But what I can do is answer that question in a future video like I'm doing here. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel, click the bell to be notified when I release a new video and when I start a live stream like my Ask Dr. Geyer live shows. Thanks so much for watching. I look forward to helping you feel, look, and perform better than ever.